Hi everyone, let us quickly revise juvenile idiopathic arthritis in less than one minute. Juvenile idiopathic arthritis diagnostic criteria, all four criteria should be fulfilled. Age at onset less than 16 years, duration of arthritis more than six weeks, arthritis of one or more joints should be present and other causes like trauma and infections should be ruled out. Now, the, the subtypes of GIA, the most common variety is oligoarticular GIA, where four or less joints are involved. Oligoarticular, about 30% cases can be ANA positive and can have a risk of uveitis. Then we have polyarticular GIA, which can have a rheumatoid factor positive variety and RF negative variety. RF positive one is the severe form. Then we have systemic onset GIA, also called as SOGIA. This is the form which will have quotidian fever, it can have hepatosplenomegaly, it can have rash, it can have serositis and can have life-threatening complications as well. The fourth variety of GIA is anthocytis related GIA. Many of them tend to develop ankylosing spondylitis, they are HLA-B27 positive. And fifth variety is psoriatic arthritis which is included in the variety of GIA. Treatment wise, most of them respond to non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, biologicals may be needed in the systemic onset GIA form.